What's the favorite religion of the media? Islam. What's the favorite religion of politicians? Islam. What's the favorite religion of Hollywood? Islam. What's the favorite religion of college professors? Islam. Everyone loves Islam, even though it calls for the violent subjugation of the entire world and for the execution of apostates and for the execution of anyone who criticizes it. Imagine a young man converting to Islam. After spending a few years absorbing Muhammad's teachings, he's browsing YouTube and he comes across one of my videos. He clicks on it and sees me saying that Islam is violent and intolerant. What is this young convert going to do? Let's find out. The Hidden Archives declares, I converted to Islam seven years ago. I love Islam with all my heart. I pray that Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala help us implement his deen in this world. And I pray that Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala help us eliminate those like David Wood. I pray that Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala gives me the honor to eliminate David Wood someday. That'll show everyone that I was wrong when I said that Islam promotes violence. Well, Hidden Archives, I hate to break your cold, dead heart, but if you want to take down the dizzle, you'll have to take a number and wait your turn, cupcake. The front of the line is here, the end of the line is somewhere in Pakistan. I know. Maybe we should get all of you wannabe assassin keyboard jihadis together and do a reality show. Who wants to kill David Wood? You spelling and grammar champs can compete in various challenges. Whoever has the best overall score at chopping through watermelons and reciting Muhammad's commands to kill critics of Islam gets to lead the army that will execute the mighty David Wood. I should point out, though, that I'm a bit concerned about the someday you guys put in your death threats. You'll defend your prophet someday? You'll obey your fake god someday? You'll take your religion seriously someday? Is Islam the religion of someday? You do realize, don't you, that the longer you wait to kill me, the more videos I will have made about your false prophet and your corrupt book, and the more attention you'll draw to my videos when you kill me? Seems like whether you kill me or not, I win, and your fake prophet loses. Sucks to be you. Sucks even more to be your prophet, because he's roasting in hell. You've still got a chance. Glad you're watching my videos.